currently in the process of uploading yesterday's video and all of a sudden right now I just hear a lot of loud booms going on outside. I'm looking at the radar right here on my computer. Looks like we're getting some crazy storm, so I'm going to finish this upload from yesterday, and then we're going to go outside and see what's going on. But anyway, good morning to X family. How you guys all doing today? I hope you're having a fantastic day. Got a smile on your face, and you're ready for a brand new video. Welcome back to the Daily Vlog. If you're not yet subscribed and a part of the family, do me a favor. Hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications, so you never miss out on any videos I post here on the channel. Well, there's the thunder. You don't see any lightning, though. I haven't seen any as well. And, oh, what the... Anyways, yeah, it's like really foggy outside. Like, I, I forget the movie, like the Night of the Dead. Whoa! I literally just got the chills from that lightning strike. Doesn't help. I saw that flash of lightning, and also that light is messed up. This seems like a lot safer of a place to be. I mean, I have some kind of roof protection. From lightning, but yet again, lightning can just bounce and boom, bam, 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 and hit me. But I feel a lot safer under here than I was out basically on that front step because that would have been bad if I got shrugged. It literally looks like a movie right now with all the fog outside. I just, I'm trying to like picture a movie right now, like Night of the Living Dead or like a Friday the 13th kind of movie vibe out over here. You know, all the fog, lightning, some guy coming with a murderous axe coming to kill me. I don't know, I feel like that'd be something that makes sense in a movie right now, but just not in real life. Zeus, and he is gone. Oh, welcome back, puppy! Hi, how are you? Up. Oh, okay, now you're gone again. Hey guys, it's current day Jeff. I just got done doing a mile right over there on my treadmill. And uh, yeah, that went really, really well. But before I talk about anything else in today's vlog, I do want to let you guys know this, that I'll be live streaming tonight at 10 p.m. over on my twitch.tv slash Jeff Saxon Vlogs. The link to that will be down below. Uh, if you guys want to come help and support the stream, just, you know, come hang out. Let's have fun. We're going to be playing some Fortnite. I'm going to be picking up some of my Twitch subscribers to be playing with me. We're going to try getting some squad games going. That's going to be fun. Uh, on top of that, I am almost done working on that very big video that comes out tomorrow. So a lot of people in the comments have been saying this one thing that Jeff's going to say it was Seb and show that uh, somebody that looks like Seb is there. Like, you know what? I'm just going to give you guys a quick little frame, like a, a image from a frame and show you literally it was Seb confronting me at Wawa. So here you go. And there you go, Seb right there in front of me getting ready to punch me in the face, which you guys will see that video tomorrow. I've been working on that all day. Like, I haven't been focusing on this vlog at all, which I started last night. Uh, that's just been because I've been focusing more on that video because I want you guys to actually see the truth and be like, oh crap, Jeff was right the whole entire time. Ugh. Oh, hey, mom. Hey, first of all, I'm going to say. Oh, what's up? Um, I was just going downstairs to go eat dinner. Alright, well on the table there's a note for you. Oh, is there money in it? No, I have no money. Oh. Uh, la, la, la. We're leaving in a few hours. Uh, please take care of the ducks and chickens. Okay. I don't know if they have their food in there for the next two days. Uh, dog food is... So basically I gotta take care of the animals. Yeah. Dog food is on the shelf. Okay. I will have their bowl ready for tomorrow. All their food for the next week is bagged and ready. Yeah. Just rip off a tag so you know that you fed them. Where is the food exactly? In the garage, on the shelf. Okay, because like I did not know that because I don't feed the dogs. But also... Got it. Give them water. Give them food. Keep them in the side yard. So it makes my job easier picking up poop. That's four things I just counted that I got to make sure I do. Or, yeah, do. Don't do. worry, it's there. Yeah. Um... If you use my truck, take the spare key because your sister needs my other set of keys. Okay. Oh, yeah. Real quick, guys. We're going we're gonna to go on to show you exactly what's wrong in a moment. But uh, go ahead and continue, Mom. And I love you. Love I'm you, on too. i flight and information on where we're staying. Our phone should be on. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to have it with me all the time, but I will check it. Well, that's why I need I to get you to... an Apple Watch, which I almost lost mine last night. Okay. Love you. Enjoy your vacation. To... Make sure... Mm. You lock the doors whenever you go out. Oh, come on. The doors are always locked. Last person in. Make sure everybody's in. Lock the doors. Yep. I gotcha. I'm going to bed because I have to be up in three, four hours. No, oh, have fun. Have a good night. Ah, oh, look at that. Got Owen. Oh, they're even giving my girlfriend Nicole stuff to do. Jeff. Let's see 
what exactly I have to do. I wonder exactly what my parents are gonna tell me to do. My mom said flight information, which is like, eh, whatever, I can track our flights. Jeff, have a great week. Please keep up on the dog hair. Oh man, that means I have to clean the house? Don't forget to feed the dogs and chickens. You may use my truck, but do not beat on it. My mom knows when I take her truck, I like to drive fast. Use my spare key. Uh, she spelled key as K-E-U. Key on board, because Darian needs my keys to get into Jimmy's house. Okay, make sure the gate is uh, up at all times so the dogs don't poop or piss upstairs. Happens to always be Willow because she's a bleep. Only Bo and Zeus is up there. I'm only saying Bo and Zeus because like Zeus is my dog. Flight information, you guys don't need to know that. Hotel, you guys don't need to know that. Um, food is in the freezer and a fridge. Love, mommy. Well, damn. Daria, you ready to throw a massive house party this week? And? Oh, you want to tell the vlog what you did like two, three years ago when the parents went away? Uh, I threw a party. And, and I didn't even know about this until I came over on, because I used to live on that side of the house, and literally, all of a sudden I just hear, boom, 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 boom. I'm like, what the hell is going on in my house? And I come over, and you're throwing a rager, you Owen, and that was it. And there's like, what, 50 people here? Maybe. And then, yeah, the next thing I'm like, Oh great, this is not gonna go like well. This is before like we had security cameras and also had a ring doorbell. And I'm like, oh great, this isn't gonna go well if my parents find out. I walk back into my apartment and then I hear on the scanner, two cops I'm really friends with, uh, I hear their badge numbers. I'm like, uh oh, for a loud music uh, party complaint at my house. I'm like, so I go outside, I wait for them, I say, hey guys, what's up? They're like, hey, you having a party? I was like, yeah. They're like, all right, Saxon, so just turn the music down, have a good night, we don't wanna know. And I'm like, you guys are the best. So I literally saved your butt that night, Daria. The only reason I got caught was because there was a hole in the wall. Wait, there was a hole in the wall? I didn't even know that part. Where was the hole? It's upstairs. So then I had my cousin come and fix the hole, patch it up, and he told my mom. Um, Wait, what cousin? David. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Oh, I forgot because he was at the party. Yeah. And he was also a little... He almost fought one of my friends. Yeah, because he's, uh, never mind. Family, can't pick them, but you gotta love them. I just had to teach my neighbor, Mike, how to properly foot a ladder to get on a roof. Uh, it's because he's running these cool lights in his backyard and all that. So I had to go up there, make sure where the hook was sunk, uh, basically to run the lights right around and uh, help him out. So how was that, Mike? Good Easy? Man. Yeah, man. Did I make your uh, life a little bit easier now? You're the best, Jeffrey. <laughs> yeah, well, people tell me that. But yeah, no, so since that is done, that is great. I'm probably gonna go back over to my house. It is hot, I'm sweating. As you all know, in the past, I've had some issues with this car. Last year, the engine went. Uh, recently, I hit a deer. Also, my fire extinguisher went off in the car. I've had some bad luck with this car, but you know, I absolutely love my Kia. To me, it's probably the best vehicle I've ever had. But mm, something has happened, and it's kind of driving me insane. So right in here, uh, we have a thing called a serpentine belt. I'm starting to think it's the original belt in this car because since I've had this vehicle, I've never had to change it at all. But one thing I noticed last night when I was driving home uh, after I found my Apple Watch after I lost it, uh, which by the way sucks, you know, because if you ever have bought something that's kind of expensive, like an electronic device, and you're like, crap, where'd it go? And you lose it in public, like you fear that somebody is just going to take it and it's going to be gone. Uh, I prayed above to the Lord. I was like, yo, Please help me out with some of the recent things going on in my life. Let me at least find my watch. Found it, but on my way driving home from that last night, my car, I turned the AC on and I noticed the serpentine belt started getting louder and louder. I was like, ooh, this isn't good. So I know there's a lot of you guys that are older or that are about my age or maybe a little bit younger that know a lot about cars. Uh, so I did some research online, but I'm not 100% sure with this. Does it actually really affect your air compressor in the car uh, to keep your air conditioning and all that cold? Because when I turned the AC on, next thing you know, the noise got louder and louder and I was just, I had to shut the AC off and drive home with no air condition. The type of car I drive is a 2013 Kia Sorento. But if you're a mechanic and this is a normal problem, just let me know down below in the comment section. Hi Bobo, look at you sleeping so peacefully. Guys, 
that is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, do me a favor, drop a like on it, hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications to never miss out on any videos here on the channel. This video was probably, I'd say, a lackluster. It wasn't the best video out there, but obviously, you know, we're on the daily vlog grind, and <laughs> I've been putting a lot of work into tomorrow's video, which I'm very excited for you guys to see the truth and see that I was at, I was actually punched by Seb. So, I don't know. Truth comes out tomorrow. I'm excited. Make sure your notifications are on for that. But with all that being said, Saxon family, I love each and every single one of you. Remember, you guys can do anything you put your mind to. Remember to stay positive as I am sweating because of the weather and also working out before. But until next time, it's been your boy Jeff. Keeping it real. I'm going to log out. I'm going to peace out. Well, peace.